<laughs> yeah, all right, guys. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you take guys, give us double so, chair, double chair. Okay, it's a different format here because we want to do this format. quickly. Because we actually just saw the um, rises HD version. Because we'd already seen the evil, the fire rises. We'd already seen yeah, the, yeah. the seen other the... things. Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> all right. No Wait, so, so is, it, is this prologue and, and trailer as mm. well? Prologue. We should split it. Okay, it's prologue first. Okay. Yeah. First of all, the prologue. Okay. It's not better than Mark the prologue. Have hope. Yes, that's the first thing. Okay, I'm going to give my thoughts and you can give your thoughts. Sure. Okay, first of all, mm-hmm. when I saw Dark Knight's prologue, I mean, we, guys who've been on Tobak for years, you know, this Tobak is almost five years old, okay, fifth, fifth birthday. WWW top, yeah, almost five. I said almost www.talkbackworld.net where real fans will, you know, the merch is in and out in the shadows. This guy is always here, so you can find him all the time. Anyway, look, you know, when, when the Dark Knight um, prologue actually came out, there was a lot of anticipation for that thing. Okay. And to be honest, that thing was actually extremely good. I mean, I remember when I saw it because obviously you saw the bootleg first, blah blah blah. blah. Then you saw the thing in actual IMAX, and this thing was serious, you know. I mean, obviously, first time you saw the Joker, you had that big bank scene, the opening shots where you're pushing into the building, blah, 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 you know, everything. Now, the thing is, though, like, when I saw that prologue, I remember when I saw it, and I was like, wow, man, this doesn't... I mean, the movie already looks a lot bigger than mm. Batman Begins, but it also looked very bright. Like, it looked like I just said, You're action about film. the prologue. No, 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 the first one, Dark Knight. Mm. So when I saw Dark Knight, I was like, man, you know, I mean... At the time, I didn't process because I didn't know what the movie was. So yeah. I was like, this just looks very much, very unlike Batman. Because if you think about it, there's never been any scenes like the Dark Knight prologue in any Batman movie. Mm. Well, like no, in, yeah, because it was very... The first time you'd ever seen anything like that in a Batman movie. I mean, but I think, like, I think, I think a point even that Phantom of Horrors was, was making was that we all thought that, okay, that is pretty much going to be the only daylight scene that you see. So as soon as that, as you see that bus <laughs> go away... Just darkness. I mean, so have but, you been drinking alcohol? No, no, I, I, I went out to the cold. Jeez, it's cold game. Night. <laughs> anyway, look. It's not so bad, mate. Right? Yeah. What is it? Is that? Yes. Carry on, carry on. <laughs> okay. It's cool as that guy. So, basically, guys, um, that was that. The new prologue now comes out, and you know we knew we've seen Dark Knight, and now we knew it was very different. It was like heat, blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah. This thing, you know what the truth is? Like, the first time I saw it, I was, like, a bit underwhelmed. I was, like, you know... What, this new problem? The new one, yeah. The first time I saw it. So, the first time yeah. I saw it, I was, like... You know, and also, the bootleg that we saw, like, this thing was not very clear, mm-hmm. right? Then I saw a better, you know, better and better versions come out. And I have to give many um, respects to Warner Brothers, the guys who take down these things. Because those guys, those quick. guys are covert, quick I'm operators. Sharp, sharp. Those guys are oh, no, I mean, they've gotten it better. So. Yeah, they, yeah, they go so good. No, no, I mean, no. Five minutes, ten back, minutes. No, back in the, in the day, it would be a day. Be on, yeah. Maybe a day yeah. or two. Nowadays, 10, 15 minutes. So you have to be quick because these guys, boom, boom, boom. And you know what? Masquerading as fans on, on website. That's what, that's what they're probably doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, finally, when I saw the, a, a decent version of this thing, I mean, you know what, man? The prologue for me, and I think it's because I've seen, the, I saw the other one. This is not of the same kind of intensity as the Dark Knight's prologue. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, it looked like a very good action scene, but it just felt like, you know, look, it's a scene... Like Inception. Yeah. It was like a very much like an Inception type of thing, and it was like a good action scene. But, I listen, man, this is just me as a Batman guy. I'm not, look, the thing looked amazing. Like, as a film, I mean, you know, you, you can't criticize that prologue, mm-hmm. you know, on a, on a movie level. But, like, as a Batman guy, I was like, well, Batman isn't even in it. It's not been in so the he wasn't in the, you know, But that's because we didn't know in Dark Knight. Yeah. We had no idea what the Dark Knight situation was. You know what I mean? But this one, we do know. So we know that now that we don't see him in this thing, it's like, man, you know, so this whole movie about Bane, you know, and a very aristocratic Bane, by the way, who basically eats caviar and uh, drinks red wine, which yes. some people have criticized me for saying that because he said that Bane is very intellectual. By the end of the day, look. He's a big brute. He's supposed to be Spanish, guys. He's Latino. He's a big brute. Okay, he's not okay, supposed to be British. If you feel like that, then... That being so said, um, saw that thing. Mekaketi from The Wire is in it. You know, if anybody has seen The Wire, it's Mekaketi. Kirkiddy. 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 Yeah. 
Okay, yeah. Uh, my so, prologue, I mean, my views on the prologue, I felt, to be honest, it's actually quite weird because when I heard about reviews of the prologue, guys would say it was exhilarating, amazing, like James Bond, like Inception. And guys said the only problem was in, with the prologue was that they couldn't actually hear what Ben was saying. For moi, I felt the best thing about this prologue Are was you actually Ben. Moi? You know, <laughs> Sorry. Did you call moi a dip? Well, you know, it's expletive. But it's like, I just think that, yeah, the prologue is all well, but it's not as good as the... I just felt the, the, the story and what's actually happened, the kind of short story of the Dark Knight's prologue of how Joker just took out all of these guys was just a lot more, more better yeah, than... Just... This is just like, okay, there, there was no real story in it. There was no kind of... It was of, a set piece, you know. You know. So, um, I mean, yeah, it was all, you know, the things was good, the songs were good, but I just felt like, if, I mean, yeah, Bane was the best thing about this prologue, but it just didn't really give me any, mm, you know, so yeah, that's about it. Yeah, I mean, look, that... It's one of those things that we've already crystallized it that, look, it was good. I mean, Ben it, should be interested. And Tom Hardy should be interested. Yes. I mean, but the, the truth is that, look, man, I mean, it, it wasn't... I didn't come out of that prologue feeling the same way that I felt after seeing Dark Knight. And that could be because, you know how it is, it's never like the first time. So if this was the first prologue I saw instead of the other one, who knows what I'd think. But the thing is that this was so on... Nobody really knows Bane the way that you know Joker. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Part two is... The Bane that we're seeing in this is actually quite different from the Bane that you're used to seeing in the comics. Mm -hmm. That's part two. Yeah. So you're not seeing this huge Spanish, big, huge, brutish guy with venom pumping in and out of his body with pipes and everything. You're I mean, seeing he's like... He's got an English accent. He's got, yes, British. And he hasn't got... You know, the piping and all that sort of yeah. things. You're not seeing all of that stuff. So even people who did know Bane... And I wasn't even a Bane aficionado. I wasn't a main Bane guy, but I knew the situation. It's not that. So it's not the same as the excitement to see, ooh, Joker for the first, let's see what it looks like, blah, 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 and everything. It's different. So Chicken and Joe. With, it, with this, they're just... And listen, you can't... I think the frenetic hype of that first prologue, I don't think you can ever get to that level. Because it know? was all new and everything. It, I mean, wasn't, it was new. I mean, maybe they should have done something a bit different. Because I mean, it just seemed like if the same kind of setup as the... Because I mean, why don't you have a prologue with Batman straight after the events of Dark Knight? No, no. Something Do you know why? Different. I know why, because it's such a big thing. And I think that because you've already set up that thing of Batman is now in the shadows. You know, he left and he yeah, said he's yeah, going. Yeah. They don't want to, like, to do that, you're almost doing it too soon. Which is why you make, the prologue was always going to be like this. Because of how the last yeah, movie yeah, ended. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but you it's see, still, it, um... it was always going to be, do you know what would have been interesting? Is if, but it depends on what the story is. Is that if you showed what Bruce Wayne is doing somewhere, mm -hmm. like if he traveled or Basically, something. I mean, it's hard to start off with like either Bruce Wayne or Batman person, I think, you know, because it just seemed like the same kind of idea as showing the villain, the villain outsmarting the guys. You know what? Villain... Yeah, no, sorry, finish, finish your Yeah, point. yeah, no, no. Yeah, finish, yeah. Broke, don't fix it. I think that that's what they, they, the rule that they used here is that it was literally the same template as yeah. Dark Knight. And I think even the viral marketing and everything is very, very similar. You know, um, yeah. Anyway, but, that's what. But Ben's not the, the Joker. Ben's not that's the Joker, man. He's not the Joker. You know. But anyway, yeah. Cheers. Uh, All right. Be as well again. Keanu for Moses. www.talkbackworld.net new forum, and I've been saying this to guys. Keanu for Moses. All Talkback fans who were on the old side, the side is now much. It's newer. It's more jabs, better economy, big business, more www.talkbackworld.net check it out join the site continue the conversation if you have any thoughts about this prologue you want to share things with have hope or the milk or anybody else you know this video is actually hot this is very you know talk back opinions you know it's the realest things you know in case guys answer what guys who are aware know this is where you come for the realest debates realest talk about all things in fandom anyway stay tuned for the trailer mm. talk back coming up very shortly Thank you. Kenneth Moses.